Hi everybody, again apologies for the poor video and audio quality but I felt the best way to do this video was, was using my mobile phone. So this is my Shadow Cloud Gaming PC and it, it, it's running on my old laptop but I'm talking to this Windows 10 machine in the cloud. And one of the, one of the questions you come across is how can you transfer big files from your local PC um, so, this, so, this, so this is my local PC here to my shadow PC, um, and the question is that, and the answer is, that there's loads of different ways to do it. You could use Google Drive, you could use Microsoft OneDrive, things like that. But sometimes the most convenient way is with simple USB thumb drives or USB hard drives, um, because what you can do is on your local PC, um, copy whatever files you want to to the thumb drive, and then what you can do is you just plug it into the USB drive on your laptop like so and then on your shadow PC open up the quick menu go to USB peripherals down here and what will happen is see it's appeared Sandisk Corp Cruiser Blade don't know whether you can read that or not but what you do is you would tick that and that that thumb drive now is being forwarded to my shadow. Now I won't be able to access it from my normal desktop but I will be able to access it if we go into the uh, let's go full screen let's go into the shadow and what you should see is if we go to this PC USB drive E there it is um, so I can now go into that and copy any files from that into my local disk C, which is you know, on my shadow or my local disk E. Now the thing to remember that, that this is very, very slow compared to normal, um, say USB, uh, USB B or USB C, because the the files are actually going via the internet, and if you've got a slow internet connection or even a fast internet connection, that's still pretty slow. So if you're doing big files, it can take a while. And also this goes the other way as well. So if you wanted to try, say, um, move gameplay files from your shadow to the USB stick, when, once you were ready, you could then unforward it and then you could access it from your normal desktop and your normal computer and then copy the files over that way. So there we go. Hopefully that's useful. Hopefully that gives you an idea of how easy it is to transfer files from um, your ordinary, you know, your, your your local computer to your shadow computer. All you do is you need to forward the uh, the USB stick or the USB hard drive. Brilliant! If that's been helpful, hit like. If you want to see more of the same, press subscribe. And I will, of course, see you again soon.